gorgeous Boulder, Colorado, exploring the many game day and campus traditions of the University of Colorado Buffaloes. The frenzy gets started on Friday night at the Pearl Street Stampede, a good old fashioned pep rally and parade with the cheerleaders, the players, and marching band. It always gets the fans fired up. The game day setting is picturesque as the campus and stadium are located at the base of the Flatirons, the facing of Green Mountain with five flat slopes. This beautiful setting is an iconic geographical landmark that sets this university apart from any other. Colorado has been playing football since 1890 and Folsom Field has been home since 1924. The stadium is named for a former coach. Tailgating is an important part of the game day tradition in Boulder. Football means food and fun for Buffs fans. We made it this fall. Brand you made it. Yep, yep. Yeah, baby. I've been coming to football games since 1969, a long time ago. Do you do this every home game? Every home game. We're here for the team, you know, we're here to watch the game. We're all here to support it. You know, it's just a lot of fun. Uh, it's not our first rodeo. Not your first rodeo. Go Buffs! Go Buffs! The Buffaloes won the Associated Press National Championship in 1990 under Bill McCartney. In 1994, running back Rashawn Salam won the Heisman Trophy, which is given annually to college football's best player. The university was established in 1876, the same year Colorado became a state. This is Old Main, the original classroom building. The University Bell is located in this building and was cracked in 1926 due to celebratory ringing after a football victory. The school colors are gold and silver to symbolize the mineral riches in Colorado, although black is also used to make the gold stand out. The greatest tradition in Colorado football is Ralphie the Buffalo. This live mascot made her first appearance in 1966. Here comes Ralphie. She's a superstar here on campus. Oh, she is. Everyone loves her. Everyone knows her. Even when the visiting team comes, they have to get a picture of Ralphie because they know Ralphie. They respect Ralphie. They realize what great of a tradition she is and how great of a mascot she is. There have been several Ralphies through the years, but the thrilling arrival has not changed. When we get on the field, I mean, you're thinking until the gate opens, and once the gate opens, then you're just running. I mean, you're not thinking about uh, any technique or anything like that. It's just keeping your legs moving, keeping up with the buffalo. Each home game, this 1,200-pound buffalo leads the team out onto the field in one of the greatest entrances in all of sports. Please join us next week as our journey takes us from Boulder, Colorado to Chapel Hill, North Carolina and the many traditions of the Tar Heels. I'm Melanie Snare with Texas Pete's Flavor of Football.